Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make this tie strap crop top. The full ribbon pattern is available for free on my blog and it goes from sizes extra small to 3 extra large. In this video I'll be making this top in size extra small. You will need Aran worsted weight yarn, a 4mm crochet hook, a darning needle and some scissors. Today I'm using Lana Grossa 365 Cotone. It's a cotton and polyamide blend. To begin, create a slip knot. Insert your crochet hook into the loop. And we're going to start by creating a foundation half double crochet chain. To begin, chain 2. Yarn over and insert your hook into the first chain. Yarn over and pull through. You should have three loops on your hook. Yarn over and pull through one loop. This creates the chain. Yarn over and pull through all three loops. You've now created your half double crochet. To create your second foundation half double crochet, you're going to yarn over and insert your hook in between the chain and the half double crochet stitch. Yarn over and pull through a loop. You should have three loops on your hook. Yarn over and pull through one loop. This creates your chain. Yarn over and pull through all three loops and that creates your half double crochet. Repeat this process until you have 100 foundation half double crochets. Once you have 100 foundation half double crochets, slip stitch into your first half double crochet to form a ring. Make sure that your stitches aren't twisted. Also, don't worry about the small gap. We'll fix it when we weave in all of our ends. To begin round two, chain one, and throughout this pattern, Chain 1 does not count as a stitch, and we're going to half double crochet into the same stitch. To half double crochet, yarn over and insert your hook into the stitch. Yarn over and pull through. You should have 3 loops on your hook. Yarn over and pull through all 3 loops. You're going to half double crochet in each stitch until the end of the round. You should have 100 stitches in total. Once you're at the end of round 2, slip stitch into the first stitch. To begin round 3, we're going to chain 1 and turn. Half double crochet in each stitch in the round until the end. Slip stitch into the first stitch. You're going to repeat round 3 until you reach round 37. And this is what your top should look like after 37 rounds. So we're at the end of round 37 and we're going to slip stitch into the first stitch of the round. To begin the edging, we're going to turn. Chain 7. The chain 7 counts as a stitch. You're now going to skip 3 stitches and then slip stitch into the next stitch. And you're going to repeat this pattern all the way around the top. So to begin, you're going to chain 7, skip 3 stitches, and then slip stitch into the next stitch. Once you're at the end, chain 7 as per normal. Skip 3 stitches and then slip stitch into the next stitch. And then slip stitch into the first stitch of the round. Fasten off. 
and this is what your top should look like. Now we're going to move on to the straps. To begin, create a slip knot. Insert your hook into the loop. Chain 7. Now we're going to double crochet into the third chain from the hook. Yarn over, insert your hook into the third chain. Yarn over and pull through. You should have three loops on your hook. Yarn over and pull through two. Yarn over and pull through two. You've created your first double crochet. You're going to double crochet in each chain until the end of the row. You should have five stitches in total. To begin row two, chain two, and this doesn't count as a stitch. Turn, double crochet in each stitch in the row. In total, you should have five stitches. You're going to repeat row two until you reach row 40. At the end of row 40, fasten off. You're going to repeat these steps until you have four straps. To attach the straps to the front of your top, you're going to measure in four centimeters from the edge. Thread a darning needle and sew your straps to the top. Repeat this for the other side. To attach your straps to the back of your top, the side with the seam, measure in 5 cm from the edge. Sew your straps to the top. Repeat this for the other side. Once you've attached all four straps, weave in your ends. Along the back seam, make sure to sew the last half double crochet to the first half double crochet. And you've finished your tie strap crop top. 